We are LMTV, Linmar Television. Linmar, your news starts now. Good morning, Linmar. It's Wednesday, April 8, 2015. Here's a look at the stories making news on your Linmar campus. Our top story, sophomores, the fun continues. There is one more Iowa assessment test to take. LMTV's Jonah has that story. Hey Jonah, are you participating in all that fun? Oh, you betcha. Sophomores will be dismissed by Intercom to go to the lower comms and take a short math tryout test next Tuesday or Wednesday morning. Those sophomores with the last names of A through L will test Tuesday morning. Sophomores M through Z will test next Wednesday morning. If you have any questions about the test, talk to Todd Goodell in the Media Center. Guys, back to you. Thanks, Jonah. Good luck to all testers. Who will represent your class in student council for next school year? Come to the Four Corners tomorrow before school to make your selections. If you can't make it before school, you can still vote by stopping by the 11th, 12th grade office until 3.30 p.m. Let your voice be heard and vote tomorrow. Seniors, the deadline for turning in courts cards is Friday, May 1st at 3.30 p.m. No late cards will be accepted. Any questions? See Mr. Becker. We'll be back with more LMTV news right after this. LMTV, we share the news. Juniors, applications are now available to become an LMTV news anchor for next year. Pick one up in our studio, room 201, today. LMTV, your school, your news. Welcome back. The First Dance Marathon is this Saturday from, 11, from 8 to 11 p.m. in the main gym. The dance is a neon out. All proceeds will go to the University of Iowa's Children's Hospitals. Meanwhile, if you ordered a Dance Marathon shirt, come pick it up in Mrs. Oldfield's office. Now, Lakeisha's here with this morning's sports. Lakeisha? Thanks, Maddie. Today in Linmar Sports, JV Girls Golf participates in a quad meet at Go Garden Golf Course at 315. Team dismissed at 2. In other sports news, be sure to vote for Linmar tennis player Tim Paulson for TV9's Athlete of the Week. Just go to kcrg.com to vote. Order your own boys soccer player t-shirt. Shirts are just $12 each. Hurry, the deadline is tomorrow at noon. See Mrs. Dayton in the cashier's office. There will be an informational parent meeting for all baseball players Monday at 6.30 in the Little Theater. That's sports, Maddie. Back to you. Thanks, Lakeisha. In news from the counselors, business majors, listen up. The vice president of marketing from Van Meter Corporation will be here tomorrow at 2.45 to discuss the field of marketing and business. Sign up in the 11th, 12th office. For more information on this story, stop by your counselor's office or check out their blog and website. Now, Jenny joins us with the Arts and Clubs. Jenny? Thanks, Maddie. On the Arts and Clubs scene, Ellen Buddies will meet today after school at 3.30 in the coffee shop. Questions? See one of the officers. If you would like to be an officer in Key Club next year, applications are available in the Media Center and they are due this Friday. Election will be at 8 a.m. on April 15th in the food court. There's a mandatory Model UN meeting in room E133 at 8 a.m. Thursday morning. LMTV and Contest Speech are looking for help with a project May 14th after school. If you are available, you can earn course hours and receive a thank you gift from Mrs. Fry. Please see Mr. or Mrs. Fry as soon as possible. FFA members are needed at Excelsior during 8th period today to help with the first middle school FFA meeting. Meanwhile, FFA members planning to attend the state FFA leadership conference need to turn in their application and $80 deposit by the end of this week. See Ms. Lemmer for more details. That's your club update. Maddie, back to you. Thanks, Jenny. Hey, Lakeisha, what's going down there in the lunchrooms today? Well, today the cooks are cooking a hot and spicy chicken sandwich with baked beans or the yogurt bar. In the food court, it's Linmar Famous Pasta Bar. That's lunch, Maddie. Back to you. That sounds delicious. Thanks, Lakeisha. Another cloudy, rainy day across the campus. Your LMTV forecast calls for more rain and thunderstorms and a high of 57. Tomorrow, more showers and storms with a high of 60. And Friday looks mostly sunny with a high of 57. That wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. Just go to the high school website or follow us on Twitter. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Join us again tomorrow. Make it a fantastic day, Linmar.